When Oregon's Kate Brown is sworn in next week, she'll make history as the country's first openly bisexual governor. As you can imagine, uh, between now and Wednesday, we have a lot of work to be done, and that's what I'm going to go back and do. Brown is taking over the job of Oregon Governor John Kitzhaber. He submitted his resignation Friday over corruption allegations involving his fiance. 54-year-old Brown, a Democrat, has been in Oregon politics since 1991, serving in both the House and the Senate. She was outed by an Oregon newspaper in what she called a forced coming out. She described what that was like in 1992. I believe it was during my early 30s that I figured out who or what I am. But it wasn't until it was written in the Oregonian newspaper that I was bisexual, that I had to face the inevitable and let those around me know. I truly believe I can make Oregon a better place to live. In 2008, she was elected Secretary of State and won a second term in 2012. According to the Gay and Lesbian Victory Fund, there are about 525 openly LGBT public officials nationwide. I witnessed the difference it makes when our community not only has a seat at the table, but sits at the head of the leadership table. Brown will be history's second LGBT governor. New Jersey's Jim McCreevy announced he was gay before resigning in 2004. Wisconsin's Tammy Baldwin became the first openly LGBT U.S. Senator in 2013. Brown and her husband have two adult children from his previous marriage and live in Portland. She takes office on Wednesday. For Newsy, I'm Elizabeth Hagedorn, multiple sources of broader view.